to the clinic today. I'm so happy to see that anyone is um, in here today. Um, actually, it's quite a gloomy day, so I was just a little bit surprised. Sorry, do you mind if I just take my hair out? Yeah, it's a bit, um, I know it's um, looking a bit greasy, but um, let me just quickly, sorry, you can wait just a second, right? Okay, thanks. It's looking a bit flat up here, but, um, um, there we go. A little bit better, um, but, um, hello again. Um, why don't I check you in? Uh, what is your first name? Okay. I'm roughly new here, so give me one second. Yeah, I've been working here for, um, I actually don't know, <laughs> uh, roughly six months, I think, less than something like that, but, um, I'm pretty advanced with the system, but sometimes, um, certain things just trip me up, as you know. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. Do you come in often? It doesn't look like I've seen you before. Oh, during the week, okay. Um, yeah, I only, um, work here on the weekends, so. I'm actually a, um, a student at, um, yeah, um, the university right next, yeah. Um, I'm actually working part-time with, um, them here as a nurse and then here. Um, but during the, um, I don't really work nights, um, but, uh, nights during the week, uh, week, uh, weekdays. And then, um, here as a reception. Um, during the uh, weekends early on, yeah, just to fill my time, of course, and give me just a little bit more money in my pocket because you know, um, getting a degree at the same time isn't so easy. So, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. so um, it looks like you're here for the um, 8 a.m. Um, yeah, mm -hmm, that one. So. Um, the doctor is running a little late already this morning. Um, we had someone, um, called in, but then we had another reschedule. Um, uh, but she's having quite a lot of, um, um, uh, dietary issues, and she keeps, um, spraying shit all over the floor. Um, <laughs> sorry, it's a bit funny when I say that, but she's, um, she's quite, um, explosive and the doctor's been having to, um, try all of these, um, things to try to stop her from shitting, but, um, sorry, pardon my French pooping, um, defecating, um, <laughs> but, um, why don't I get you started with, um, the little, um, thing to get you started with all the information. I'm gonna just take down your name again. And uh, can you state your date of birth, please? Okay. Okay, good. And, um, have you had any, let's see, what does this say? Sorry, I can't really read up close that well. But trust me, I have 20-20 vision out there like nothing else. But, um, have you had any, um, exposure to anyone, like your family, friends, or coworkers? Anyone in particular that has had COVID-19 within the past week? Okay. Alright, good. And do you have the COVID vaccine? Okay. Yes or no, we just need to know that. Okay. No trick right here. Okay. So, why don't I highlight for you um, the information you'll be needing to fill out as you wait for the doctor. As of right now, I think the doctor said he was around... 10, 15, maybe 20 minutes late. Yeah, I'm so sorry. We could have called you in advance, but um, we didn't take a number for you, unfortunately. And we didn't really, let's see, there's no real phone number, just your home phone number that looks like it's been discontinued um, for some time now. So if you don't mind giving me just your um, um, new and improved phone number, please. Mm, okay, two, okay. So, 
I'm going to just highlight the parts that you need to fill out today, um, just for the doctor, and then you can um, actually give that straight to the doctor itself, okay? Yeah, okay, Let's just take a moment. If you want to take a seat, that's totally fine. I know our, um, our chairs are a bit, um, a bit hard, stiff, but um, we're looking to um, improve that, but I've um, sent in a pretty complaint um, to the doctor. So, um, that's what I do online basically all day. I kind of shop um, using the work computer, but, um, um, yeah, I like to shop, but anyways, um, why don't I just highlight these parts really quick, if you don't mind waiting. Mm -hmm. And then just towards the bottom of your agreement here, I just would like you to, um, sign this little part in a big, big highlight, okay? Alright, so, let me just cap that, give you a pen, open it for you because some people are incapable. So, here you go. Awesome. So, um, as we wait here, I'll just be kind of doing my own thing. Just replying to emails and such. I'll let you get a little bit of a head start. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. If you don't mind, I'm just going to um, fix my hair for the millionth time. Sometimes I get a little bit of OCD when that happens, but I'm just going to be replying to um, some emails really quick. Sorry, I look like so greasy from the side. Um, I kind of care about my appearance a lot. As you can tell, I'm a bit of a... Um, Fastenista, as they say. You know, got the nice deep vaser, um, um, uh, what is it called? Not a, a blazer, sorry. Doink, doink. Um, my necklace to kind of show my youth and my gold hoops, of course. Um, there we go. My hair's a bit ratchet, but that's okay. Um, but can I? I couldn't. I couldn't. I couldn't. Um, just between you and me. I couldn't stop looking at your pants. Where did you get those pants? Okay. I, I, I saw you come in and I was like, dear lord, those pants are just like, so eye-catching. And I was like, I need me a pair of those. Because, um, I need more attention, and I need, I need, I need those to help me do that. So they're the dad, dad 2000. Okay, I'm going to look that up actually right now. If you can just give me one moment, please. Mm-hmm. Of course, of course, okay. Sorry, when I get a little bit nervous, I like to talk. Yeah, you can probably tell that right now. <laughs> so sorry, but uh, at least we're getting to know each other just a little bit more. Mm -hmm. And since no one's in here today besides you, you're the real trooper, so I give you all my attention. Mm -hmm. So, what do you like to do for fun? Oh, wow. That's fun. I'm a little bit of a... Um, let me just uh, save that. I'll finish that later. Um, I'm a little bit of an active person myself. I um, play soccer at the university I'm going to. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so um, I like to run, kick the ball inside the goal. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. It's fun, you know, getting with the girls. Um, but you see how my hair is curly? My hair's naturally curly, but I straight ironed the little shit out of it because um, I don't like my hair curly. Because um, every girl has their hair straight. But maybe I should go back to going cur curly. Do you think I should go curly one day? I know we just met, but I feel like we're getting a really deep connection right now. Yeah, and I'm so sorry for my nasally voice. I'm getting off a little bit of a cold right now. Now, just hold on, I know you were going to say that. Um, I am not contagious. I tested negative for COVID. 
granted, I did test positive for all these STDs, which I did not know I was going to have. But, anyways, still never, still negative for COVID-19, and um, uh, it's just giving me this dry cough in like my throat. My throat is just so dry. So um, there's been some really dry coughing. So um, pardon me if I do, um, you know, cough. That is. Um, but um, today, um, you have no uh, serious condition coming in today, correct? Okay, good. Um, I just wanted to ask because um, as a receptionist, I've seen quite a bit of walks of life here. And I can say that um, it gets a little bit um, crazy. Um, and I thought um, getting away from my waitress job would give me the sanity um, from these crazy people. And working as a cashier, sorry, that was my dry cough, um, but um, working as a cashier at a pharmacy, I also was seeing a lot of weird people, but the other day, um, it was really late at night, I was working with the doctor, and this woman comes in with her husband, and she's in cuffs pink fluffy cuffs, okay? And she goes, Doctor, I can't get these off. Her wrists were bruised. And I said, Honey, um, was 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 this intentional? Like where's the key? And I said, Honey, I don't think this was um an accident because I've dealt with this type of situation before. Anyways, yes, I'll cut it there. But um she the doc, she came in, she said, Doc, I can't get these damn handcuffs off. So I said, oh my god, um, Doc, you're gonna have to cut off her hand. And then, yes, yes, I know that was a bit extreme, but, um, the doc reassured me that he could just cut the, um, handcuff off of her for wound condition. Yeah, that condition was never said even to me, so I'm not really, um, sure what that ended up being, but, um, yeah, yeah, but, um, I have to tell you about this one other time, okay? This woman, she, um, she came in, she had some really long nails, and I'm saying, I have pretty long nails, too. I mean, they're not, like, too long. You can see, like, the tips. And I do have a new color in, because the doctor always wants us to have these nude nails. Never, no freaky nails, okay? So I just have these nude, nude nails. But she came in, she's some really long nails. And, um, so, like, long nails, like that one, and they were hot pink, and her pet rat, okay, her pet rat thought they were, it was some food, right, and, um, the rat just, like, bit off her whole entire, like, tip of her finger, and it was, like, gushing everywhere, I said, oh my god, I could not imagine my pet rat, because I have a pet rat, too, in fact, I actually bring him to work, do you want to see him? Yes, no, trust me, you want to see him, so let me just get him out the cage here. Come here, little Thomas, 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 Thomas. And here is my pet rat. Don't be startled, um, I actually thought that, um, that, um, rats were also disgusting because they are, in fact, um, a pest, a little pest, but my Thomas here, <laughs> silly Thomas, um, Thomas is not Thomas is not a pest, do you see? He's cute, he's cuddly, and he's um my anxiety animal. Mm -hmm. No, this is completely sanitary. Um he's clean as you can see. He does walk on the floor, but um, uh, that's the only thing he does. Mm-hmm. Anyways, her rat just like chunked off her whole finger and I, it was bleeding everywhere. She was holding it like this with some tissue. I was like, oh my god, girl. Oh my, oh my god. And doctor fixed it. He can fix pretty much everything. I know, I've only been working here six months, but um, he's kind of helped me with a lot of things. So, uh, anyways, I'm going to put Thomas away now so he doesn't um, crawl onto your things. But um, did you finish your um, your information? Okay, but can I, can I see that? Yeah, I just want to make sure that you... Um, Build out everything that you need to. Yep. 
I'm going to actually highlight uh, what you all had here and double check with you. Okay. So it does look like you have a history of um, diabetes in your family. Is that correct? Okay. Just making sure. I have to double and um, quadruple and um, whatever the thing is that you go ten times. Yeah, I, I highlighted it ten times. And what about um, heart kidney failure? this all highlighted for you. You can take this in with the doctor when he finally arrives. It looks like he'll be needing Looks like he'll be needing like five more minutes to wrap up things. Um, and then you'll be in next, of course. But, um, I can't lie. I'm starting my, um, uh, my artist career, and um, I like to draw you if it's possible. Um, it can be a little bit scary, but you can just sit there, sit there, be on your phone, whatever, and I'll just draw you, okay? It'll only take a moment. I draw really fast, because I'm kind of, um, kind of good at this, so just stay there, good. ready to see. Hold on, I'm almost done, trust me. This is you. Um, I think I did a pretty good job on um, myself, but um, you see, um, you're smiling, you're happy, uh, and you know, I also drew a lot of hearts around you because you're a very caring person. I see, and you love you love life. Um, your eyes, they're very um, apparent, and I see that. Um, they're quite actually beautiful and handsome, no judgment. Um, and I drew, um, your little, um, blush marks as well, because you're just so happy. And if you see, if you go down, I drew your outfit down. Your flare pants are just amazing. Um, so, the dad's 2000. Okay, good. Again, when you're probably in there, I'll be, um, shopping. So, good to know. Neil's have a long sleeve shirt on, so you look comfy, you look cozy, you look awake, but hopefully you'll be able to go to sleep tonight, but um, thankfully um, it looks like the doctor is um, ready, and i like to uh, thank you for your time here today in um, the clinic, and I'm still trying to master the front bang part. As a child, I had bangs, but um, they took a while to grow back, so that's why I had um, a little bit of a lion's mane um, when I was a child, but um, I'm glad that um, we got this time today to um, hang out and um, enjoy each other's um, company. So, I know you wish never to see me again properly, but 
um, you'll have to see me when you walk out because you'll need to give me um, some paperwork again. So, um, sorry, but you'll have to see me again. Alright, I'll let you um, go on to the doctor's office now. But um, again, I'd like to thank you for your time and I hope I kept you a little bit occupied with my little ramble. But trust me, it's just, um, just my anxiety. Mm-hmm.